Hello. Um, graffiti. <laughs> um, I love graffiti. I absolutely love graffiti. Um, but there's a distinction. There's a distinction between graffiti and vandalism. I don't like vandalism. Uh, it's not something Art Factory um, encourages or really tolerates. Um, I have compassion and I, and I have kindness. Um, and, and Art Factory actually was tagged or vandalized and I just went out and sprayed it and covered it up and that was it. I didn't really give it any thought to be honest. Um, but there's a lot of comments and uh, a lot of keyboard warriors out there with uh, pretty hard comments of, you know, and I always find that there's teaching moments and that there is kindness and compassion and and also consequences but I think that there has to be a balance and I think that it's you know I'm a proud father and I have a daughter that I love and I know that um, we need to be beautiful and we need to encourage positivity and there are um, rules that are broken and rules that need to be respected and and uh, and I'm sure that all of those things will be taken into consideration with um, with the appropriate governing bodies that deal with those things and I I'm very proud of the OPP and I'm um, and they've been very kind to me and so um, David Peace who was a constable actually became a friend when I moved here he was uh, very supportive and I really appreciated him um, during his time here um, I think he's moved on about two years ago and he he worked somewhere else but he came by to say thank you to me and um, when before he he was relocated so I and I know um, I know that they do their best and I'm thankful for them and I know that the mayor Tom Sidney is trying his best to I know I get a feeling that he really cares and he is he's trying um, to uh, to balance everything and and he, he he cares so good for him and I encourage him to continue um, we we have communicated and uh, I have made suggestions and offered my expertise and the resources and connections that I have and my facilities to help encourage um, murals and allow for the use of my my factory to and uh, all my resources to help encourage creativity and to make our community as beautiful as it can be um, and and that's great um, graffiti is is an art form street art is an art form um, Painting is an art form. Vandalism is not. There's a big distinction. That is like if someone went over and got a hammer and smashed someone's window and then you said, well, you know, uh, the hardware store can offer you some, some uh, uh, trade or uh, teach you how to build a house, you know, or that's like, well, someone got a can of spray paint and fucking deface something. That's not art. <laughs> that's not art at all. It's actually just uh, like I, um, so, you know, artistic expression. Well, uh, you know, uh, I don't, I don't really see the connection between D 
defacing and vandalizing a building and, and uh, needing artistic expression. Um, you know, and I say that, you know, I'm, I'm a professional artist and I've been painting for 30 years. And so um, I take a lot of pride in, in, in uh, what I create and I have a lot of passion and involvement in what I create. And um, that's what being an artist is. And that is um, a healthy uh, pursuit of involvement in your life and expression of yourself. And I treat my art with, with absolute respect and with courage and dignity and, and artistic freedom and where I express myself in an effort to be as sharing as possible. And, and my passion and love for art and the benefits of art I wish to share with, with um, my community that I feel has been incredibly kind to me, incredibly supportive, and has welcomed me with open arms. And, you know, thank you, Renfrew. You are, you are a place where I really feel at home. And, and I hope that we can continue in that same way uh, with everyone. Sometimes just always bear in mind kindness, please, in your thoughts and that we all make mistakes and we all can do better. We all, I was a total shithead as a kid. Like, I mean, I terrorized my neighborhood and I was, I would have been locked up for fucking a thousand years for all the, all the stuff I did. And, uh, you know, I, in my journey, I had some really, beautiful people and I always believe that good things come with sunshine and water and and with uh, more involvement and more compassion and and that breeds respect and that's we have to teach what we wish to have and sometimes our patients are really low and I gotta tell you I wasn't thrilled about my building my pristine wall that Rick Widows and we built that outside of that building and we stepped back and we looked at it and we're like you know what that is a pretty damn nice looking wall and, and now it's got you know it's been tagged <laughs> and you know what um, that's okay it's um, art factory goes over and You know, Rick Widows really worked his ass off. He put his, all of his skills and talent and hard work, and let me tell you, the, this project is so demanding, the art factory, so going over and spray painting the outside of the building isn't, isn't, <laughs> it, uh, I'm still smiling. And I, and you know what, it's, it, it really is just a building. Let's not lose sight of that. It's, it's property. Yeah. It's like, might be my dream and might be my, my opus or my Magna Carta of, of, uh, what I wish to share. And it's my most, it's something I've really worked hard at, but it's just a building and it can be fixed and it can be changed and we and no one you know we need to be we need to do better we need to love better we need to continue like how people have been in this town has been so beautiful and so nice to me and and the love that people have extended and brought gifts and donations and offered services and 
been inspired and the love that people have graced us with is, is honestly incredible. It's so supportive. And Art Factory goes over and offers free art classes for all youth every Friday from 3 till 5. And you can donate towards that. 100% of the money goes towards our, our community and our youth. I don't put a penny in my pocket. It is, I lose thousands of dollars offering this. And I do it because I believe in doing better. And thank you. And we have an art fair this weekend to celebrate community and creativity and it's free for everyone to come and we have like 70 plus artists with all their tents it's going to be amazing and let's have a beautiful day so live love art and stay safe and be kind <laughs>